Hey everybody, it's Spike here. Uh, today's Sunday, February 15th, I think. Heck, I don't know. I've at least tracked the date. Anyways, I'm out here at the old garden and uh, decided since I got skunked the other night up there around the root cellar, so I'm gonna change it up a little bit. I come over here on the north end where the old bulldozer pile is. I found a few pieces here in the Oh, the roots of the trunk there, and anyways, I've cleared me out of spot here, just digging into the side of it, see what I could find, and this thing broke, but boy, it would have been a killer, base of a sedalia here, just flipped it out, oh man, I mean, you talk about thin and beautiful, the colors of this thing's un unreal, man, I mean, it is so pinkish, thin, God, that would have been a beautiful sedalia. Look how thin that thing is. I know one thing for sure. The guys that made the, the points around this camp knew what the heck they was doing. Just awesome, awesome workmanship. I don't know if it shows up better in the shade. Or not. Anyways, hopefully I can find a whole one in here. I'm due for an Etley. I haven't seen found a broken one for a long time. All right. Hopefully I'll get back with you later. Yeah, it's Spike again. Here's Sunday the 19th. Man, it took me a couple hours, but I finally found a another piece of something here. I mean, look at this hole I've dug. I mean, I moved some dirt. <laughs> I got another broken sedalia base, and I got something somewhere down here, right here. Man, that was a heck of a tool. Of course, it's busted. It's busted. One of them Sedalia diggers, I think. It's a nice one. Would have been nicer if that would have been all there. Anyways, it was right underneath this old stump right here. It had been pushed in here years ago. So, not hardly finding any flint, but I just got a feeling I got to keep digging here. Something's going to come out good. Alright, get back with you later. Hey everybody, it's Spike again. It's been about five minutes here. I'm just digging out around this stump here. It's kind of going quickly. Wasn't going through the dirt real good. And right here, I was shoveling the dirt out of the hole and I thought I'd seen something that looked like an arrowhead. Right here. <laughs> Man, talk about a awesome sedalia missing a tip. God. Dang. Oh my god. This sucker. This sucker is unbelievable. My goodness. This is the ultimate heartbreaker here. Wow. That is so thin. Look at that. Gosh, man, why does that sucker have to be broke? It is so cool, the flint. It is translucent. Oh, man. I gotta get that thing cleaned off. I'm gonna do that right now. I got some water over here. Let's see if I can show you guys what this thing looks like in the sunlight real quick. Bear with me. I'll just get back with you here in a second. Okay, I'm back, people. You know, that's what's, what's so fun about digging out here. Is because every time you come out here, you're one shovel full away from finding the artifact of a lifetime. 
Man, oh man. This sucker sweet. Look at that. Son of a gun. That is one beautiful, beautiful piece of a rock. I'm definitely going to keep digging in that stump. In that dozer pile now. If I can find one of these suckers whole, man. I'd dig for a week to find one of these. That is one, one sweet broken sedalia. Probably one of the nicest broken ones I got. I got a lot. Man, man, oh man. Alright, I'm going to try, try to see if I can get a hole in here before dark. Get back with you. Thanks for watching.